It is uh, throwing a few showers in parts of uh, central and north central Nebraska. Stormcast has that all fizzling out as we head through the overnight starting uh, tomorrow with mostly sunny skies. I think tomorrow may be a top 10 day starting off a little on the cold side, but temperatures will get very close to 70. Not a whole lot of wind and a ton of sunshine. One of those days. So by 6 p.m. starting to see an increase in cloud cover from west to east. Maybe a few more clouds as we head into Wednesday afternoon and maybe a spot shower. I'm not going to say we're going to, um, in my forecast, I don't have rain for Lincoln on Wednesday, but someone might see a shower here and there. Notice it's very uh, hit and miss, so we'll see. Temperatures tonight on the chilly side, uh, anywhere from the freezing mark to just barely above 35 in Lincoln, 36 in Beatrice, 34 in Seward, but notice Kearney right around 32 degrees. Uh, mostly clear tonight for Lincoln, near normal. That's very close to where we're supposed to be at this time of year. Uh, then tomorrow, uh, middle and upper 60s. We may see a few 70s out there, but really a nice day. Light southwest wind, plenty of sunshine, maybe a top 10 day with 68 degrees and plenty of sunshine. Seven day forecast back to 70 on Wednesday. Again, that spot shower possibility there. Thursday and Friday, a little cooler on Thursday as that frontal boundary moves through, then back to 71 on Friday, then whoa, summer uh, for a couple of days. Uh, Friday, excuse me, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. Temperatures in the lower and middle 80s. Just wanted to point out the record high on Saturday is 89. Uh, so I don't think we'll get close to that, but I mean, it's a few degrees away. That 84, the record high on Sundays in the 90s. So we're getting to be that time of year where record highs are, are up there, but some 80s for a few days in a row. How yeah, looking like a lot of beautiful days mm -hmm. there in a row to enjoy. Definitely feeling like April, right? Yeah, get outside. <laughs> Thank you, Rusty. Now to the 2024 election.